we have um, so we we have a group of uh, executives that, that that that's very good in kind of maintaining and building a good relationship with existing co uh, customer. Uh, we really need to broaden that. We need to broaden that both in kind of vertically broaden it. For example, we have uh, the top 10 banks around the world are, are major customers of ours, right? But there are about 3,000 banks. So, so you just keep going to the top 10 or 20 banks. L lovely customers, no complaint. I see them a lot. But we need to get to the next 1,000 banks, for example. I think we, we, we need a different mindset in that thing. Other verticals that we haven't really penetrated in, like healthcare and so forth, we should do a better job there. Uh, they are also regulated industry, so they have the similar kind of MO, so to speak. Um, globally, so there's a lot. And in, in some of our businesses, I think there's a surface component that could make revenue and grow. Uh, I don't think, you know, traditionalists doesn't really attempt those things. So, so after a while, you, you just need to make sure that you have people that with a mindset they want to expand. So the fastest growing part of your business was a newly acquired Silence, that cybersecurity company that uses artificial intelligence technology. You bought it for $1.4 billion. Its rival, CrowdStrike, just went public, doubled in its IPO, and is worth $13 billion, despite having basically the same revenue profile uh, before they went public or were acquired. And I know the two gentlemen uh, have a healthy rivalry going on between them, but why is there's such a disconnect between the price you paid and what CrowdStrike is trading for in the public market? Because I'm a smart investor. <laughs> well, that could be one answer, but is there a material difference between what they offer, the growth trajectory, its market position, who its clients are? I mean, one billion and 13 billion, you could drive Several trucks Good through question. that number. Good question. So CrowdStrike focuses more on the enterprise customers. Uh, Silence focuses more on the small, medium enterprise customers. Um, and in, but we bought Silence for the technology, not so much for the you know. We are, we're, 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 we're taking the Silence, uh, the machine learning technology, onto our UEM, our endpoint management. I think that differentiates a lot. Uh, against people like Microsoft or other, other you know, Mobileye, and they're too small anyway. So those people. Um, and then we're going to put it in a car. Uh, so you know, the future autonomous car, or even the connected car, has the intelligence to scan for your safety, for you know, security, and so forth. So that's, those are all things that, that we bought Silence for. Um, and, and I think it's a matter of nobody expected CrowdStrike to get that kind of multiples. Uh, so when we bought it, we're paying Forward-looking, we paid about six and a half times. And if you think about six and a half times, most of the enterprise companies are getting about four times. So you know, people even complain about, oh, you're doing too much. But of course, it's not now, um, because of, partly because of the growth profile. So I think, we're, uh, you know, I think we did a very intelligent deal there. Still, at the board level, do you talk about how you can get BlackBerry to at least garner the kind of valuations that a company like CrowdStrike is getting, which is now valued more than BlackBerry combined with all its businesses combined. Are you frustrated at the board level that the market is not rewarding the entities within your company? I think, I think the, key, the key is, well, nobody likes. <laughs> frustrated is too strong a word. Um, it's something that we pay a lot of attention, the board pay a lot of attention to. Um, so I wouldn't use the word frustrated. Uh, something that we need to work on. Uh, there are two components to that. Number one, I don't think CrowdStrike is going to stay at their valuations, uh, but that's a different issue. Um, uh, I, I do believe that we need to get better valuation and recognition by, on BlackBerry. And it has to come from executions. And I think we had a great strategy, got a good set of products, and um, you know, government and company trust us. Uh, we should be able to grow our business. And, and we'll get the valuation. I know that's a question that analysts were asking on the conference call. Again, at the board level, do you think you guys are sitting ducks for an activist investor to come and enforce more meaningful change at the company or try and do something to accelerate and, and unlock value? Do you think like that at the board level? What would an activist the come in and try and do? The board always prepare for that kind of scenario. I don't think it's wise. Um, I think well, we are tackling one of the major markets that's coming, which is the secure IoT market. 
Um, we're, internet we're, of things. we're building, yeah, Internet of Things. Sorry, Internet of Things, and and we're building various components to 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 make that a very competitive offering. Silence is just one of that. So it's not really about buying silence and store it up separately. It's really buying silence to fulfill a long-term uh, strategic goal. So you know, it's just this requires a little bit of patience, but. Not a, not a whole ton. You can, if you recall, I mean, you, I know you follow the story for a long time. Um, if you recall, some five years ago, we were basically a, a hardware company and trying to, try to struggle to make a dollar. Um, we now, this year, we're going to be over a billion dollars in software, and it's mostly in the cybersecurity and privacy and security side of the equation. And, and we, we will make money, and we said the year will be accretive. Um, so. Um, I, I think it, if you look at it from that lens, um, it's a reasonable you know, progress for the company. So the, the key is, what would the next five years look like?